BoldQuest is a joint combined capability development activity uh, designed to improve the way that we operate as a coalition uh, in a variety of um, venues for future operations. Looking back to where BoldQuest started and where it is today, it's made huge leaps and bounds over, we'll say, the last uh, eight to ten years. And in my personal experience over the last three or four years, it's been huge. Um, the expansion of BoldQuest to include uh, all types of fires, uh, the advances we, we've made in combat identification, and uh, this year, because we've started to integrate cyber with our other command and control activities, uh, it's, it's huge. In my personal and professional experience, it's really the only developmental activity that I can think of that really brings together all four services, and in this case today, 13 nations on top of our own. In the past, uh, we've, we've tended to train separately and then try to put all this together uh, when we meet out there in the field of action. Uh, but BoldQuest has changed that, that paradigm and, and it matches exactly what we're trying to do here is to say, let's build a, a, on the, the training side of the house and on the testing side of the house a, a, a level playing field, a team of equals, where we bring all this stuff together here uh, and, uh, and work through that before we go out there. The Camp Atterbury and the Muscatatuck complexes have just, it's second to none. Uh, the opportunities that we have out here are just outstanding. The ability to have all these nations come to one place in central Indiana and, and come to, and bring their system so we can tie them together in one single network is got to be one of the best uh, experiences I've seen. It couldn't be any better. We love coming here. I think it's awesome. I think it, 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 I think it works out really well, and I think it's part of the challenge that you get when you come here, that you know that you're going to be working with other people that are expecting certain things from you, and, and it just it boosts your 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 morale, it boosts your will to to excel at what you do. But overall, I have to say, the whole thing came together very nicely. It's uh, it's it's working out. People are going to go away from here saying, yeah, we know what we need to do. We need to, what we need to fix to get this thing working. What we'd like to do. Uh, with Bold Quest is take a look at Army modernization and how we maintain interoperability with our joint and multinational partners as we modernize. We don't want to modernize in a direction that takes us away from interoperability with our joint and multinational partners because that's how we're going to fight future conflicts. So how do you do that? Well, we think by, by linking Bold Quest and the network integration evaluation together, we'll be able to get uh, maintain our trajectory, our momentum on modernization, and at the same time maintain that interoperability that we've worked so hard to attain. So this is uh, truly a, a coalition of the willing. They're bringing their own equipment. They're, they have a particular problem that they're trying to solve. Training events have their own objective and timelines. Here we're really focused on development and problem solving. We evaluate needs every year, and so depending on emerging technologies, depending on new problems, it's always going to be dynamic. Um, it has grown, that's for sure, uh, and we'll, we'll keep doing as much as we can for as long as we can.